This is Wes Hickey, Executive Director of TCPA, and want to touch base on a new change in regard to certification real quick, and then also talk about award nominations. Uh, one of the things that we all need to be aware of is that they are changing how they are counting the number of tests attempted on the Texas uh, effective September 1st, 2018. Uh, you may remember that uh, three years ago, two and a half years ago, that they took, a, they, they started this five test limit. And, but they said that any test taken prior to September 1st, 2015, didn't matter if you took 80 tests or whatever it took down the line, those all counted as one. Uh, the thing is, that was for a limited time only. And effective September 1st, 2018, Instead of it just counting one, now it counts the actual number of tests that the student had. So if they are in a situation where they would exceed the five test limit after September 1st, 2018, they need to make sure that they take the opportunity to go ahead and take the test ahead of time. So you might want to tell any of your students that have struggled over time with the test uh, and may have been grandfathered in for a while that that ends effective September 1st, 2018. The other thing, guys, is that I'm uh, going to put with this the forms to nominate individuals for Advocate, Researcher, and Educator of the Year. Uh, we're going to send it to Dana Beatty again. Uh, and so all that information is on the sheets of paper that I send right there and uh, th that we're sending with this email. And I certainly encourage everyone to make sure. We have great, great, great people in TCPEA. And we need to make sure we take the opportunity to get some recognition for some of these folks. And certainly at TCPA, let us know what we can do and remember to inspire and educate the architects of human potential.